and um, basically when this map is shown, there's going to be rules above. You're going to read the rules before you join the roleplay. And just see if you agree with them or not. If you don't agree with them, just let me know. Um, it, it's pretty easy. Once you're in the map, it's pretty easy to see what is on the uh, board. But uh, all on top, all on top is what you're going to be seeing for rules, especially if you're going to be joining the roleplay server. So we're going to have cops that are randomly there, uh, sibs that are going to be randomly there that volunteer when they join. Um, it's going to be a pretty crazy, pretty crazy experience. If you look at my other videos, my other live streams on here, you'll see that um, they're pretty crazy. Yeah, I'm in an invite only. I'm just kind of telling everybody how um, role plays are when I post this video. We have um, we have cops. We do have criminals, but we try not to have too many criminals. Usually, when somebody is a criminal. They are working at a job, so any type of job that's posted on the map, we're going to have new interiors added uh, pretty much every week. And um, we're just going to go from there. We're just going to update the map from there. We're going to have new people. If we don't have as many new people, we can expand other games, but I think that we're going to keep doing these. They're pretty fun. A lot of people like the hood role plays too, so... The hood role plays aren't really as much rules. Usually a fail RP is a block if we've warned you multiple times and it's five dollars to return. Especially if you're just gonna keep on griefing in the server, there's no point in joining. But uh yeah, no draw and draw, no VDMing and RDMing, no killing or fighting in the first ten to fifteen minutes, no cop baiting. And um it, it's pretty easy, man. As long as you're um following the rules and stuff, usually there's no beef. Everybody uh, gets along fine. It's all role-played, you know, scripted shit inside of the match. As long as you're, uh, you know, no draw and draw and stuff like that. You're not running other people over for no reason. Shooting people for no reason, that nature. Uh, cops go on cars at Mission Row. Go 10-8 at LSPD. I mean, I can teach you that stuff. That stuff's pretty easy. But all this other stuff, advertising job on the phone, you just literally text everybody that's inside the job. Hey, you know, this job's open, Los Santos Customs, you know, um, wherever you're working, wherever you can think of. We also add jobs every other, um, like literally every other day. So, um, it's realistic, you must have a job, no metagaming, which basically means that if you get killed, you're not going to come back as the same person. Uh, it, it's a huge map, so I want you guys to have fun. You know, treat it as if it's a real server, because we are on console. And uh, just appreciate it for what it is, because we can glitch inside some of the interiors, including the police station. So, act as if it's real life. It's uh, not a crime server. So there's no crime 24-7. If I tase you or somebody tases you, you stop. And um, you try to have fun. You know what I mean? Once you once you get tased, you go inside your vehicle, you follow the police officer to jail. Whether you're going to jail or if it's a ticket, you're going to comply by the rules. If you don't comply by the rules, I mean, hey, it, it's, it's your server to have fun in. If you don't want to have fun in it, make another PSN if you want to. Um, it, it's really made for everybody to have fun new people to um join the community stream if they want to you know basically you know bring their own community into a community on youtube and i want everybody to um follow the rules when they do join so i will be having people going back to this video once i post it on an upload but uh those are the rules if you guys want the updated rules list i'm sure i'll update it 